Hey, before this video starts, I just want to mention, if you want to commission me for a video posted here on YouTube, come over to when I stream either here on YouTube or on Twitch at Retro Mario Twitch. But, let me not take up your time, enjoy the video. Looks like the boss wants a lot more souls than what we're usually out here for. Well, I'm not the one to argue with him, so might as well do what he asks. Speaking of, hey, you finally woke up? Oh, don't worry. We're in a very secluded place, away from the city and whatnot. Well, we're in some woods, and we're inside of a cabin that seems to be abandoned. So I thought, what other good place to get the souls that my boss needs than to be inside of a creepy abandoned cabin inside of the dark woods. Well, you see, my job is a little more complicated than other people's jobs. You can, um... You could kind of call me a reaper of some sort. To put into better words, I... Well, I kill people for a living. And I capture their souls for my boss to have for him to regain his strength. And if he doesn't have the right amount of souls, one of us gets punished for it, and I'm not gonna go behind my quota tonight, so that's why you're here. I don't need to tell you anything about my boss. He's very secretive, so he likes to have his private life. Me? Oh, I can tell you everything about me. Starting off with my name. Actually, it's kind of rude of me because I didn't really introduce myself when you woke up. So here, let's do introductions. Hi. I'm Hoodie. You? Alright, I could care less. Anyway. I didn't come here to have small talk with humans. I came here to get souls and kill people. Like my boss told me to. Small talk wasn't in the contract. So... Yeah. Why else would I? No, I would have... What a dumb fucking question, first of all. And second, why wouldn't I? I'm a murderous person. I'm a murderer. I kill people for a living. And my boss pays me very well to do it. No, oh, trust me. This is my real face. I can touch it and everything. I can even... T I can... See? I can slap myself. This is my real face. Well... If you must know... My boss did this to me. You see, my boss isn't human. 
He's something different. You ever heard those uh, old stories about a uh, eight foot man who's very malnourished and he had no face but he was very pale and he would put letters, drawings, posted on the trees inside the woods. And did you ever see those old news articles about some children and adults going missing inside of those set of woods? Mm -hmm. Now you're getting the bigger picture here, right? That was him. He collects people, kills them, takes their souls, and uses them for his own power. But now, he's quite weak, since a lot of people forgot about him. And so, he'd hired me and two other people to help get those souls for him. So he could regain his strength, and then afterwards, he could do this by himself, and then, he would still pay us. But, he'd be doing his own biddings, instead of having us take his fall for all the murders. Right, sorry, I went on a little bit of a tangent there. My face, he did this to my face because he gave me some powers. Yeah, yeah, powers. Um, you could say that I could be superhuman. But, to be honest, I always didn't look like this. I was a human like yourself. I don't even consider myself human anymore. Because, well, I, got, I have powers of some demon of some sort. I don't know what it is, but my boss made me look like this, and now I can summon tendrils out of my back anytime I want. And they're pretty helpful, honestly. Although, getting used to the pain when they come out of my back has been quite a bitch to handle. To be honest, I don't even remember what it looked like when I was human. All I can remember now is this face. Enough about my sad story. I'm here for a reason, and you are my reason. So, let's get this over with, shall we? You know, missing out on human life is a little bit more interesting to put into words. How I've missed so much stuff in the past years, ever since I started working for my boss. Always up to something. And yet, here I am. Going to kill an innocent person like yourself because he needs power. But, he does pay well. <laughs> so, do you have any last words, or are you just gonna yell at me? Uh, of course, alright. They always wanna start something, but 
before they die. Really pitiful thing to see humans act like that. <laughs> and yet, I was just like them. But now I'm better. <laughs> anyway, my next target. Hmm? Who the hell is calling? Private number. Hello? The hell are you calling me for? sure the proxies know of this, and I'll also tell Slenderman. Alright. Catch you later, Jeff.